Mr. Trump is a racist. I'm here today to tell you that Mr. Trump is a racist. <laughs> wow, I thought that would be a bigger reaction. Um, I am providing a copy of a $35,000 check that President Trump personally signed from his personal bank account on August 1st of 2017. This is a check Mr. Trump wrote me as reimbursement for hush money I paid to Stormy Daniels. And this is a copy of the check I wrote to Ms. Daniels. The copies of letters I wrote at Mr. Trump's direction that threatened his high school, colleges, and the college board not to release his grades or SAT scores. I'm also including a copy of the threatening letter I sent to Mr. Trump's high school warning them not to release his SAT scores. <laughs> it is even more painful to admit that many times I ignored my conscience and acted loyal to a man when I should not have. For too many years, I was loyal to a man when I should not have been. Now I know how Khloe Kardashian feels. Shame on you, Mr. Jordan. Uh, Mr. That's not Chair what I said. Shame Mr. On Mr. You. Mr. Chairman. That's not what I said. What I said is I took responsibility and I take responsibility. What I was doing is explaining to the gentleman that his facts are inaccurate. I still, I take responsibility for my mistakes. All right, I am remorseful. Quote, Mr. Cohen appears to have lost his moral compass. Burn. <laughs> Mr. Cohen has pled guilty to a smorgasbord of fraudulent activity. Yeah, and then right after that, it says, at the direction of President Trump. It does? Oh, damn it! <laughs> You're a patholog pathological liar. You don't know truth from, from, tr from falsehood. Thing, sir. Mr. Cohen. You are a pathologer. Pather patherological liar! <laughs> you don't even know truth from frictionals! But there's no truth with you whatsoever. That's why that's important to you, to look up here and, and look at the old adage that our moms taught us. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Mm. No one should ever listen to you and give you credibility. Now you are the liar! That's been established! <laughs> that's why I went to Kink Rose and I print up this in. <laughs> Liar, liar, pants are fired. You made some very um, demeaning comments about the, the president that Ms. Patton doesn't agree with. In fact, it has to do with your claim of racism. Uh, I couldn't help but hear Mr. Cohen call President Trump a racist. But it just so happens that I brought with me a black woman. <laughs> and she works for Trump, don't you? Uh-huh. And her name is Omarosa. Oh, no, that is... No, no. And she has stood by Trump's side since the first season of The Apprentice. Oh, oh, that is not me. Can I leave? Oh, I have lied, but I am not a liar. And I have done bad things, but I am not a bad man. I have fixed things, but I am no longer your fixer, Mr. Trump. Maybe I'm not a good person. Maybe I'm a liar. Maybe I'm a fool. Maybe I've ruined hundreds of people's lives. I'm, I'm sorry, is, is there a butt coming? No, there isn't, thank you. And live from New York, it's Saturday!